Hello, in this video, we're going to learn how we can change the sky box behind the code. So let's get started. For this example, I'm going to use these free sky boxes available on Unity Asset Store. Let's download it. Let's import everything. The sky boxes has been downloaded. These are my five sky boxes. Let's create a script, C sharp script. I'm going to name it skybox script. Apply this script on the scene so that it can run when you run the application. Just drag and drop this script on the MPT script game object. Double click to open in Visual Studio. Now let's create some public properties of material. I'm going to use Skybox as a material and will apply it on the scene Skybox. Let's create another one. Name it Sky 2 and Sky 3. Now in the start, I need to access render setting dot skybox equal to my material of the square box. In this case, I'm going to do sky 1. Let's go back in our Unity 3D. Go in our skyboxes folder. Click on this script. As you can see, these are my public material variables that I have declared in the code. Over here, just drag and drop sky1 or you can just select from here. Select this and select this. Control S to save. Let's test our application. As you can see, the skybox has been changed with the help of code. If I'm going to select like sky2, control S to save and start the application. As you can see, the sky2 has been applied. So that's how you apply a skybox behind the code. That's it for this video and I'll see you in the next video.